Film and video students at College of the North Atlantic in Stephenville are in the process of filming and editing their final films for the semester. I've talked to a few of these students to find out a little more about what it takes to <laughs> Each student is required to uh, you know, write a script, then put together a cast, a crew, shoot a film. It's, uh, you know, less than 15 minutes is the required length. You, some small crews probably have five to ten, and larger crews might have up to 30 people. You know, depending on the scope of the project. Well, like I said, you got to write a script, uh, you know, that needs to be edited and worked. Uh, you have to look for locations, you have to find the cast. Um, I mean, there's a lot of preparation that has to go into this sort of thing. Shooting so, is only half the battle, it seems. There's plenty more work to be done after the final shots have been captured. Doing your rough cut and then your picture lock where all your like where the whole timeline is going to stay in that place. Then after that it would be color correction, and at the very end it would be after effects or special effects like CGI and green screens and stuff like that. So there's a lot after uh, you finish the actual just filming and like all the pre-production. We, we're going to have our own film festival at the end of the year to present all the films, but hopefully uh, going to get one women's film festival or the nickel and small things like that. For 30 at 30 News, I'm Stephen Windsor.